We're at Little Stony Creek um, up here outside of Elizabethton, Tennessee. We just released 389 juvenile brook trout fry. The Southern Appalachian brook trout is the southeast only native species of trout. Um, the rainbow trout and the brown trout that people may be more familiar with were actually introduced uh, for angling. And when they were introduced and combined with some clear cutting back in the 1900s, the brook trout was actually restricted to only 13% of its historical range. What the Tennessee Aquarium Conservation Institute is doing is rearing these fish in-house and then releasing them back to re-establish a native population of this fish. This project involves a high degree of collaboration. The Tennessee Aquarium Conservation Institute is responsible for providing the fish, but then the Tennessee Wildlife Resources Agency helps us plan out where the need to stock them is. And then the U.S. Forest Service has done a lot of trout stream rehabilitation to make sure that when we put the fish in, it's the right habitat and they're gonna survive. We're here in the Cherokee National Forest, so all of this is protected land, which is why it is in such a beautiful natural state. For a lot of people who like to fish for, for brook trout, that is, you know, half of the enjoyment for them is just being in such a beautiful natural area. And that's also very important for brook trout survival. Uh, they have to be in cold water, so without all of these trees that shade the creek, they wouldn't be able to survive. So, you know, it's really a big picture thing. You have to protect the land, not just the water and not just the fish. What's really cool with this project, too, is we actually have a club called Trout Unlimited uh, that is full of people who are just really passionate about fishing for trout and also for uh, you know conserving the trout they love to fish for. They actually funded this project completely so that has allowed us to be able to do the work to get these fish back in the stream for everybody to enjoy. The, well the southern Appalachian strain that's what God put in this area you know it's the only fish in this area the only trout species in this area that, that God put here himself. The, the Southern Appalachian brook trout are the only native species to this area. There's a lot of different organizations that came together to, to raise funds, a lot of grant money and a lot of hours put into it to get something like this done. And it's just great to see everybody come together, all these different groups of people, different diversities, different age groups, uh, just come together and, and try to get this common cause done. It's, it's a great thing to see. With the brook trout, we raise them throughout the late winter and the spring to about two inches long. That really increases um, their success and their survivorship. And that's when we complete the cycle and we put them back in the river to be wild fish. You know, today is the day when we really get to see what it's all about. You know, we work really hard back at the facility. Um, you know, we spend a lot of time working with these animals and to actually be able to come out here and watch them swim away into the water to fulfill the ecological role that they were meant to. Um, you know, that's what makes it all worth it. You know, that just kind of really brings the, the purpose home for me. <laughs> it's a great day. It's the best day. <laughs>